Manner of Frights, presented by HorrorAddicts.net Press. Imagine a Victorian house where every room is cursed with a frightful existence. Are monsters in the halls? Ghosts left to fester in the library? Or are the rooms themselves enchanted with malevolent energy? What was summoned long ago, and what doorways were left open? Manor of Frights is a collection of tales all set in different rooms of the same house. Flowers in the Foyer by D. W. Milton Everyone at the manor knows there must be fresh flowers in the foyer every morning. But why must there be a new housemaid named for a flower every fortnight? Storage by Ollie Fox A servant locked in a storeroom finds there are far worse things than being caught by the master of the house. By Baby Bunting by Leslie Warren First time mother Ida Wells thought losing her husband was the worst thing that could happen. That is, until the baby came along, bringing hell with it. Withered Bindings by Michael Fassbender While cleaning up the study in preparation for the master's return to the manor, Philippa finds half the books on one shelf rotten under the influence of a mysterious tome. Dinner Guests by Emery and Rich A dutiful butler attempts to keep zombies at bay without letting the family know anything's amiss. A Green Thumb by Daphne Strossert Eleanor breaks into her friend's conservatory to take a clipping of her prized orchid, only to discover that the plant has more exotic needs than she could have ever imagined. Turning Pages by Mark Orr A ghostly pianist is witness to a gruesome murder and takes her revenge in a like manner. A Fresh Start by DJ Pizzolatus a woman looking for a fresh start after a tragedy finds something far worse in her new employer. The Living Room by Amanda Leslie There's something alive in Jenny's living room. She hasn't heard it or seen it yet, but she knows it's there and that it pulsates with a sickening version of life. Lanai by B.F. Vega A family secret proves deadly for one of the young heirs to the Castorelli Sugar Fortune. Cacophony by Judith Pancoast. Annalise is a gifted young pianist who reaches another level when she begins playing the haunted piano in her new home. Night Bears by Lauren Rhodes. When Jimmy gets sick, it brings a whole new meaning to the monster under the bed. Beyond the Ensuite by Bond New Stratton III. The ensuite bathroom hides a hidden bathhouse that contains delights and horrors only a wild imagination could conjure. The Desiccated Heart by Samiko Salson. Some punk kids have an idea for the perfect garage band, but an item found in their practice studio soon makes it all go to hell. A Study in Terror by Jason Fisher. A family heirloom brings terror to a small girl staying over at the manor, but what her mother doesn't realize is, it's best to listen to the little ones. Come Find Me Mummy by Rosetta York When single mum Debbie, accompanied by her three-year-old daughter, catalogs the manor's contents to prove herself worthy of a place in her family's firm, she encounters horrors beyond her worst nightmare in the nursery. Missing by R. L. Merrill. High school senior Christy is creeped out about volunteering in the manor for the 100th anniversary open house, but working in the scullery turns out to be even more menacing than she anticipated. To read these stories and check out the floor plans, search Manor of Frights on Amazon or go to our site horroraddicts.net and click the Manor of Frights banner. Manor of Frights. Would you be brave enough to enter? And would you ever be able to leave? <laughs>